Hi, Hiram here. I thought while I was out here doing tests on pots and stuff, I do another one on a, another cook set that I've been requested to do a bunch of times. This is the Stanley Camp Cook and Cup Set. It's a stainless steel single walled cook set. Um, you just, it has a handle on it, you just pinch it so that it opens up has a nice little lid with perforations for draining and for letting for venting. Inside are two plastic mugs or cups. Looks like these things could go through the war and still survive. And then you got the pot. Now the size on this is, well it has different diameters here but right here in the middle it's about 3.61 inches in diameter. It's 5.65 inches tall. Has a nice little clip handle here. You just squeeze the handle and then you can pick it up, drop it into place. Has measurements on the side, 20 ounces, 16, 12, and 8 that you can see from the inside. Hope you can, yeah, you can see it there. And like I said, a nice little lid. I'm going to try it on this coddle stove, the one with the wicking and the corrugated aluminum pot stand inside. <coughs> okay, I've got two cups of water here. Now this is nowhere near as wide as the Boy Scout pot, so I assume, I know what they say about assuming, it's not going to have that good of a boil time compared to something wide like the Boy Scout pot or the grease pot that I did earlier. But we shall see what we shall see. Let me start this. Well, actually on the wick, I can just put the pot right on. Now, the bottom of this isn't flat. There's an indent on it, so you got to be careful with that. Now again with the wicking, it just starts right up as compared to the other one where there was no wicking. So that's 61 degrees, two cups of water, 61 to start and it's already jumped up. So 61. Let's see where this goes. There we have 210, 211, 212, and 515. That was two cups of water starting at 61 degrees, came to a boil at 212 in 5 minutes and 15 seconds. And just for grins, let's see how long this takes to run out. Okay, and there goes the flame going, going, let's say gone at 726, huh, not too bad, considering this has two strikes against it, one it's not a wide pot, and two it's made out of stainless steel, so considering that this still came out pretty nice. Okay, I'm going to use the carbon fiber as a pot holder to pick this up in case this is hot. This is a real nice, doesn't weigh anything. You use a piece of scrap, you know, use it for a pot, hang, pot holder or all kinds of stuff. Just lift it up off, a little puff there of whatever vapor was left over. So, I don't know, not bad. Considering this thing looks like it could <laughs> be driven over or stood on, I bet you I could even stand on this thing and it wouldn't crunch. Not bad. So that's the Stanley Camp Cook and Cup Set. For those of you that have asked, quick wrap up here, run over again. It was two cups of water starting at 61 degrees, came to a boil in 5 minutes and 15 seconds. The Boy Scout pot uh, was 4 minutes and 48 seconds. So that's like what? 
a minute or minute and a half longer. Then run out was seven minutes and twenty six seconds. I think if I was going to use this, which I just might, I don't know if I'd use these cups. Did I go over the weight? I don't think I did. The whole set with everything, the cups, the pot, the lid, weighs 386.5 grams or 13.63 ounces. Just a cook set with the, the top and the pot weighs 217 grams, 217.8 grams or 7.68 ounces. You don't have to write this down. I'll put it down in the text area. One cup by itself weighs 84.8 grams or almost 3 ounces. Two of them together is 168.8 grams or almost 6 ounces. So these things are kind of heavy. Although I guess maybe they are insulated if you were going to use hot, real hot water. But I think I might just use some of my other cups. So maybe you'll see this in one of my outdoor uh, videos coming up. <clears throat> So for those of you that asked, I hope this helps. I thank you for your requests like that. Always look forward to stuff, looking for stuff to do. I thank you for watching my video. I look forward to your input, questions, remarks, helpful suggestions. And as always, watch for my buddy Max. Bye now. No, you've been a good friend. And that's in the thick and